Welcome to Movie Magic Scheduling. Today, we'll be looking at stripboard basics. After entering all your information in the breakdown sheet, click the bar at the top to access the stripboard and start the scheduling process. Red strips indicate the strip is currently active. Clicking on another strip will turn that strip red. You are able to drag and drop strips in any order you prefer. To select multiple strips at once, hold Command while clicking on the desired strips. If you're on Windows, hold Control instead. To select a block of strips, click on the first strip, then hold Shift while clicking on the last strip. Let's take a look at the icons up top. First is Insert Daybreak. Clicking this will insert a daybreak below your currently active strip. Moving the daybreak strip will automatically tally any information above it. Next is the Insert Banner icon. This allows you to insert notes or reminders below your currently active strip. The next icon is Delete All Daybreaks. Clicking this will ask you to confirm removing all daybreaks from the stripboard. Auto Daybreaks will automatically insert multiple daybreaks based on a number of pages. Clicking on this will ask you how many pages you'd like to shoot per day. The Reorder Strips icon allows you to reorder your strips based on the scene number. The Cut icon and the Paste icon allow you to cut a strip in order to paste it in a different part of the stripboard. Delete Strips will delete the currently active strip and the associated breakdown sheets, so be cautious when using this function. The Move to Boneyard icon will allow you to place strips into the boneyard. The boneyard allows you to move strips out of sight, but not necessarily delete them from the project altogether. Once you move an item into the boneyard, you can always pull it back into the stripboard whenever you'd like. Clicking on the Sort icon allows you to select different parameters to sort the stripboard by. The Undo and Redo icons allow you to cancel or repeat your last action. The Show Calendar icon gives you an at-a-glance view of your project. Here, you can drag and drop strips between days, or even move whole days or weeks around in your schedule. The Show Boneyard icon shows items you've stored into the boneyard. The Show Conflicts icon isolates the currently selected strip or strips and will highlight scheduling conflicts if they exist. Hide Header Board allows you to toggle the appearance of the header board. This function is only available in vertical layouts, which you can select here under Layout. You can also change which board you'd like to view here. And if you have different calendar options, you can choose to view them here under Calendar. And those are Stripboard Basics in Movie Magic Scheduling. Thanks for watching.